On the way back from Lewis's funeral, my mom told me to start packing. She waited until the day before we left to tell Edie. I'm not sure if she wanted to make it easier or harder. I wish we'd stayed. But I understand why we left. My mom ended up leaving everything behind. What happened that night had been coming for a long time. Maybe it should have come sooner. But it had to end one way or another. All that's left now was to tell you about that last night. Last day, Edie just watched us pack and didn't say a word. Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, To our final night together, and all our final nights apart. Grandma, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very Edith, specific. I left a present for you in the hallway. Why don't you go open it? The grown-ups have to argue now. I'm sorry, you're right. We're all leaving tomorrow. Let's just enjoy our last... I'm not leaving. Edith, you're excused. Oh, I thought she was pregnant already, dude. It was back in the day. The power had been shut off that morning, but Edie always had plenty of candles. When my mom sailed the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance. Or that Edie had a key to it. That thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. Edith has a right to know these stories. My children are dead because of your stories. I think it's best if Edith and I leave tonight. We'll have the nursing home send a van for you in the morning, okay? Dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you, but there's only time for one. This is about what happened on the night you were born. That night, the tide went way, way out. Tsunami? It was the first and last time I ever saw the old house aground. There'd been an earthquake out in the middle of the ocean. No duh, dude. That's they a tsunami time. The lowest tide in a thousand years. God, it smelled awful. You know, I've seen that house every day of my life. But I never thought I'd go back to it. When the fog rolled in, I lost my way. I got turned around. I start 
looked at seeing things. It's obviously jumping from scene to scene because I'm just pressing forward. Things I'd you know? forgotten had ever existed. There was a jump right there. You can see it because this the floor closest to me disappears. But when I saw them, they felt like old friends. That night, a lot of things came back to me. Or maybe I came back to them. Well, she found it. The gates Things and hinges still. Whoa! Explain, but that I need you to try and. Edith, what are you doing in here? It's mine, Edith. Mom, you're gonna rip it. Let go. I kicked and screamed, but Mom dragged me to the car. Good stuff. I never saw oh. Grandma Edie again. The next morning, the band came to pick her up, but. She was already gone. After that, we moved around a lot. I used to do this when I was a kid. I think everybody did. We both did. tried to make the best of it. I used to make a little man running on the top of the tree a line like that. A few years went by and she ended up humping and getting pregnant. You sick bitch. My mom didn't uh, 17. Like to 17 but year she old. She getting sick a lot. <coughs> oh. The rest happened pretty quickly. She got better for a while. And then she didn't. And then I was alone. So she had to go hump some people and get pregnant. That's how it Last is. Last Finch left alive. Until I found out about you. So you got the daddy issues. I'm still not okay. sure what to tell you about all this. Pregnant at 17. If we lived forever, maybe we'd have time to understand things. But as it is, I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes and appreciate how strange and brief all of this is. Oh shit. This the vagina to be for you. But now I hope you'll never see it. I just want to meet you and tell you all these stories myself. I guess if you're reading this now. You've been aborted like that. I'm just kidding. Things didn't work out that way. Oh, shit. This is where your story begins. I'm sorry I won't be there to see it. It's a lot to ask, but I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. What the I fuck happened? I want you to happened? be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. Good luck. There she died. The fuck? This story, dude. It was a good game, dude. I liked it. Got kind of weird, though. I wish I could understand the, the meaning. You know, you could probably look it up and stuff. I know it's like... Your own thing. Your own interpretation, I guess. There was a lot of... Yeah, that's pretty cool.
Oh, she even drew it in. Alright, I'll, I'll play the credits and then if there's anything else, I'll show it. But otherwise, I hope you guys like this game. That was nice, I liked it actually. It wasn't that bad. Nice storytelling kind of game, you know. But it was nice. <laughs> Imagine the whole team just fucking died <laughs> like that. <laughs> oh shit. Alright. Well, there's that, dude. That's everything. Even Don's here, too. Like, Don and yeah, I didn't even realize. But I hope you liked this game. I liked it. It was pretty cool. So, yeah. I don't know, free to play if you have Xbox Game Pass and then you can play it on PC like I'm doing. Other than that, I'll see you in the next game. Listen, you creep. It's not your money we want. It's your ass. I'm sorry to hear that. What the fuck is this piece of shit? Like, comment, and subscribe, or I'll break your fucking legs.